Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new WWE pay-per-view predictions video. As usual guys, I am not alone, thank goodness. I really thought I was today. really thought I was going to just do this alone. It's a stacked card, so I really wanted a bunch of people's opinions. And then D2, because no one cares. Um, so yeah, D2, what's going on man? Welcome. Let's move on. Flame, how you doing man? Hello there. So, Flame, how are you feeling confident? No, because it's a quite a difficult card to predict, to be honest. What match are you looking forward to the most? Um, the 5-on-5 five five male tag. Alright, and we've got a newcomer. Welcome, Kieran. How's it going? Yo. That's, that's Kieran. So, yeah. <laughs> I will go with the least important person first, D2. Um, Enzo More versus Kalisto for the Cruiserweight <laughs> Championship. Enzo. Enzo More to retain. Anything you want to say about that? No, just a basic match. Fair enough. Flame. Enzo More um, to retain him. Yeah, no one cares. Mm, kind of. It's sad though. Uh, Kieran. Uh, Enzo to retain because Kalisto is somehow worse than Enzo. <laughs> I'm I'm gonna go I'm gonna go the same as everyone else. I know that's boring, but yeah. Um, I really don't want Kalisto to win. I know Kalisto can actually put on a good match. He's a good high flyer. He's he's decent, but he's got no charisma. He's got no he's got nothing. I mean, it's just boring. So yeah, Enzo, but boring match. We move on. This this actually could be a really good match. I don't know why they're giving it to me second on this list. Oh, there's actually so many matches and they're all really good. So, yeah, New Day versus Shield. D2, who have you got and why? I got Shield because Shield is just better than Us uh, the New Day. <laughs> <laughs> You're just better than me and I can't see them losing to them. So, wait, who did you say? Shield. Oh, you actually went with the shield? Yeah. I was really scared. Yeah, I thought. I thought. Yeah, I thought he was gonna say New Day too. <laughs> All right, Flame. Who have you got, man? Um, the shield because the shield's first actual match back on pay per view was a trio on May. And Kieran. Uh, it's got to be the shield, Sean. Unless they decide to do. He'll turn straight away with one of them, which surely they're not going to. He's got to win. Oh, if they did a heel turn this early on. Would you like to see that, Flame? I know you've been wanting Dean Ambrose to turn heel, so... No, because it'd be better when there's more build to it. I agree, I agree. So, you're Kieran, what, what are you going with? I'm going Shield. Alright, I think, I think, I mean, yeah. I mean, I think that's really safe to say, isn't it? Unless they really do pull that shot, which I didn't even think about, but... If anyone was to turn heel, but they're not going to turn Roman heel, so I'm not even going to say that, but Dean Ambrose, it would be great. I'm going to go the shield, hands hands down. Easy. All right, let's move on to, um, yeah, one great, great person. Yeah, just one of the best in the WWE right now against, not a great champion right now, Miz versus Baron Corbin. Could have potential to be a decent match. I don't think it has potential to be a great match. Uh, I it's just that they can both be ha they both can have good matches, but I don't think they're gonna fit. I just don't see their their wrestling styles fit here. And I think it's gonna be the worst match on the card except the Enzo Kalisto one. Let's just make sure I said that. Um, so I will start off with Kieran. Kieran, who do you have and why? Um. Right, well, I've seen some of their stuff, on, which I still don't understand. <laughs> it's I, I it's don't confusing, really to say the least. Yeah, I don't really understand this, apart from it's a champion versus champion. Yeah, well, it's literally um, a Survivor Series. I still don't see them giving Baron that huge a push, whereas they seem to be behind the Miz, so I'll go with the Miz. They, they seem to be really backing the Miz recently. Like most episodes of Raw, like the main storyline kind of runs through Miz, which I love. Um, Flame, who do you have, and why? Um, not Miz. I think we're gonna see like usual Miz tactics, like yeah, Mister Rush or something. No. interference or like 
But then this is heel on heel, you know, like Baron Corbin, like. I know, but I still think Miz will because they're not gonna have. I can't see them, even though Baron's not like a massive star or anything. I just can't see them having like a tough, big tough guy like Baron like lose clean to the Miz because that's what WWE is like. So you're going Baron Corbin? Oh no, I'm not Baron Corbin. I said I think Miz is gonna like cheat or something to beat him. Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm Baron. That's right. Yeah. D2, I know you're going to go with Baron Corbin, but... No, no, hold on, hold on. No, no, I'll, I'll let you say what you have to say. I think it's going to be... I actually think it's going to be a decent match. But I, I think <laughs> Miz is going to reverse the end of days and hit the Skull Crushing finale and win. <laughs> you actually got Miz! <laughs> It's because I said you have the worst predictions ever at the beginning of the video. You you want to just show to Kieran that that you're not you're not a weird predictor, no, but like you you if are. Kieran's gonna lose. I want to be a reverse from the end of days. Fair enough. I agree. Okay. Well, I uh, I'm gonna go you with. Gotta uh, you gotta hit the deep six. I just think the bitch should squash him. To be honest, for a bit bad. Yeah. yeah. I'm gonna go with Baron Corbin. Interesting. Gonna go with Baron Corbin. Um, uh, for once, I'm literally not thinking of just this match. I'm thinking of what they're gonna do in general, and I think the overall team are all gonna get the win on this pay per view. But I think Miz can eat a loss right now. He's been good. This match means nothing, and I think that there are a lot more matches that Raw are gonna win. So I think they need a win here for SmackDown. Respect. Thank you. It's not because I like Baron Corbin. I don't think he's awful, but I, he, I don't think he's a very good champion. Let's move on to... <laughs> I'm not joking. I don't normally say this, but the match I'm looking forward to the most. And that's not of, of, often. <laughs> that's not often a match I look forward to. I know Kieran is going to be looking forward to this match, so I'll go to you first, Kieran. Alexa Bliss. Abe versus Charlotte. A match that I'm really not looking forward to, actually. What? Did I just Cause... completely get you wrong on that? Wow. <laughs> no, normally I would be excited when Alexa's wrestling. But the two but... best females in WWE are wrestling. Yeah, but I know that Alexa's losing, so it's hard to get excited for it. Alright, so I'm not going to ask you who you're going to go with. Yeah. So yeah, you're going with Charlotte. Oh, well, that's, that's interesting. Alright. Fair enough, fair enough. Any any reason why? Uh, Charlotte's just won the title. Alexa's ha had the belt for a while. She's established as a champion. Charlotte needs to win more than Alexa at the minute. Yeah, that's that's, that's fair. Absolutely. Uh, Flame, who have you got, man? And why? Charlotte. Charlotte and that's pretty much for the reason you gave for Baron Miz because Smackdown need a win <laughs> yeah yeah basically. interesting yeah basically alright um, D2 who have you got mum I got Charlotte winning but Carmelo cashing wait really yes the fifth woman I get well I get that I get to that in the Women match, the five we do this for like every pay per view, though. <laughs> yeah, he did for the last three pay per views. He's like Carmella's cashing in, man. <sighs> to be fair, I've been thinking that she's gonna cash in. All right, you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna stick with that, D two. Charlotte wins, but then Carmella's cashing in. Yeah. Okay. Sheamus and Cesaro versus the Usos. Flame, who have you got and why? Who says they're the best tag team in WWE? Sheamus and Sorry will only just won the ti the titles back, and like they've pretty much just been flip flopping with the titles. The Usos have actually had like a, you know, like a pretty good reign. They've been topping pay per views with the New Day, so the Usos should win this match, and I think they will. All right. D two, who have you got in white? Like Flame said, they're the best tag team in right now, and. I can't see them losing right now because they're so the way they're building up. They're strong, you know. Mhm. Mm and Kieran, who do you have? This is probably the one that I'm most unsure about. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it, I, I'm not going to be disappointed if it goes either way. Both teams deserve to win. And I love both teams. I think we all love both teams. Uh... Yeah. 
I think yeah. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with the Usos because SmackDown need to win some matches. And yeah. I've <laughs> predicted pretty much just Raw so far, so Usos. Okay. All right. Okay. Um. Hmm. I yeah I I'm really I'm really stuck on this one. I have to admit. Like, now that I said that Baron Corbin and Charlotte are going to win, that's two wins for SmackDown already, right there. Um, but then, I don't know, it's... I don't want to just base my guess off of that or my prediction off of that, but... I'm actually going to go with... Yeah, I'm going to go with the Usos too. Uh, I just think that... I love both these tag teams almost equally, but, like, the Usos have, like, a slight advantage because I just... They're just so good. And like the bar are so good as well, but like I know I, it's they're both great. I'm gonna go with the Usos. The five on five women's match, guys. Uh, oof, this is uh, an interesting one. I, is it gonna be a good match? Seems like it's gonna be a mess. Um, I feel like at least it's gonna be a mess. This, I don't think it's gonna be the best match unless, <laughs> unless, the fifth member is is someone special. I'm gonna get into that in a little bit, but I think all of you guys are going to cover it yourselves, but the 5-on-5 five five match, I'm not going to go through who's in every team, uh, but Smackdown only have four women announced right now. D2, who do you have and why? Smackdown or Raw? I have Smackdown, I, Paige is not going to be the fifth member, it's going to be someone else, but if Carmella cashes in, Paige is going to go in for her. Wait, 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 what? <laughs> what? Okay, hold on. I, I think Carmella's cash in, right? So that frees up as. But you don't spot. think Paige no, is going to be the I, fifth spot? I feel I like this match that. is going to be before yeah. the title match as well. No, I can't see it being before yeah. the title match. Because there's two elimination matches, so it's probably going to be quite early in the card. Yeah, this is this is, this is is going to be before the titles match, dude. Yeah. Is it? Probably. Oh, well, either way. Yeah. Either way, I guess Paige fifth member smack on this. So who do you think? Okay, who do you think this fifth member is going to be then? Let's have two predictions on this. Who do you think the Paige is the fifth member? Yeah. Okay, but and you're going, you're going with team. Team blue. Team blue. All right. I don't, I don't think Asuka is going to be. I think Asuka is going to get taken up by Dana. Someone. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wait. By Dana Brooke. Wait, this is this is so oh, weird. So I'm watch. I'm on. The, I'm on the screen right now for the match card. They've put the red background behind the the SmackDown superstars and the blue background behind the. the I'm. I got so confused. I was like, what? Since when is Asuka on SmackDown? <laughs> she should have been on SmackDown. She, definitely. Um. So D two Team Blue, yeah. Yeah, basically. Naomi Page, Becky, Carmella, and uh, Tamina. Okay, Flame, who have you got, man? Awkward silence. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's... The one is quite tricky because the fact that you've got a potential returning page and also an undefeated Oscar, Remember, it's WWE, though. But I can see Raw winning this just because I think the bragging rights come past Raw, like, past Survivor Series, like, on the Raw or whatever, it's going to be like, oh, Raw won, but both yeah, but the thing team. is, Alicia Fun Fox is on Team Raw. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I, I like Alicia. She's been great recently. It's a good character for her, but it's, it's, it's she's Alicia I Fox. Raw is going to pull it off. Asuka's probably going to have a dominant display. I don't know. Like, it's a hard one, but I'm going to go Raw just because I think. You're going Raw? Like, after it. Yeah. All right. Uh, Kieran, who are you going, man? Uh, team Red or Team Blue? I have two predictions for this one. All right, well, f f Flame, wait, just before, your fifth member's Paige, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Your, that's actually your prediction? Yeah. All right, yeah. Kieran, who's your prediction for the fifth member? Uh, it's either going to be Natalia or Paige. Right. So, so... If it's Paige, then I... Either way, I'm saying Asuka's getting taken out quite early. Okay, and yeah. Then, mm -hmm. They're going to do something like they did with Braun last year. Just take her out. That's uh, definitely possible. If SmackDown, if Paige is the fifth member, SmackDown are winning because it's Paige returning 
they need to give her a win. Yeah. If it's not Paige, then Raw's obviously going to win because they've got the better roster, really. All right, so here's my prediction. I, I'm so worried it's going to be Natalia. I really am worried, but in a way I'm like, Natalia will get booed out of the building if it's... If it well, if enough people actually think it's Paige, I'm not sure how. Like, if just the casual people there all think it's Paige as well, but I mean, I don't know. Now that they're doing this secret fifth member thing, if, I thought if 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 it would have been Natalia, they would have announced it on SmackDown or on Twitter or something like they do. But now that they haven't, I I do think it's going to be Paige as well. So I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go with Paige returning or yeah, making her debut, whatever you guys want to call it, after almost two years or one and a half. I'm gonna go with uh, I'm gonna go with team team Raw anyways. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go with team Raw anyways. I think I think she will return, but I think they will make her lose. I don't think it'll be that significant though, because it's a five on five. There are ways of making it so she doesn't look weak. She could be like the last member or something. I don't know. I'm going with uh, I'm going with team Red. D two. The five on five match. This is gonna be. I'm. I'm so so excited for this match. This match is is gonna be so much fun. There are so many possibilities and combinations of wrestlers here that I'm looking forward to. Most of them contain Kurt Angle. Um, so I'm gonna go and give my prediction first. Actually, um, I'm. Yeah, Team Red. Team Red. I think. I think they're gonna win. I think they're gonna win quite. It's gonna be quite close. I think it's gonna be again like last year, really long match. Uh, D2. Who do you have and why, man? I want SmackDown to win, but Raw's gonna win. Yeah. Anything else? Other than that, you know, since Triple H is on now instead of Jason Jordan, I can't see them losing. <laughs> Flame, who have you got in my month? Raw are gonna win. I want Raw to win, and I think the last two on Raw are actually gonna be Triple H and Kurt Angle for that interesting little dynamic. Oh, that would be cool. <laughs> I think they're pretty much facing each other. Right? A wrestle, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah raw. I think we can agree on that. Uh, Kieran, who do you have and why? You see, I I feel like there's so many possibilities to do with this match. Like, I'm pretty sure they're going to do Kurt Triple H at Mania. Yeah. That's pretty much a shoo-in. Mm. But then you've got the whole Samoa Joe Finn yeah, well. that that could just come back, will, couldn't it? Will they work as a team? I'm not so sure. But it looks like they have very well. It looks like they have, but will they actually when the pressure's on? But then, I'm, wow! I, I, I just I just realised that team team SmackDown is they're all faces. Braun is in this match, isn't he? Braun, yeah, yeah. Braun's on team yeah. Raw. So then that adds another dynamic in as well, because Braun's a monster. He could he could probably win the match by himself. Yeah, and then you add it, yeah, all right. So you're, you're going Team Raw, yeah? No, I'm going to go as Team SmackDown. You're going Team SmackDown? Yeah. As in Team Blue? Yeah, because I, I think Triple H and Kurt are going to end up fighting. I don't think Finn and Joe are going to work together. So you're, then... you're basically saying that Kurt Angle gets fired? I'm not saying he gets fired, I'm just saying... He gets fired if he loses this match. Does he? Yes. Oh, well... Well, Triple H is back now, isn't he? They well, want him on, they're going to want him on telly, I'm saying... He just came yeah, back, didn't he? I'm saying SmackDown wins. No, let, let's just clear, he doesn't get fired... Well, he, he gets cleared for... He gets, clear, he gets fired from general manager, which means he could be just a superstar. Which, I which would then fit into the to a good storyline for him to face Triple H. Yeah, I think SmackDown are winning. They bring back the authority after they're then they're like they take charge again and then they build up. That that's such a possibility. Yeah, definitely. Flame, what do you actually think of what Kieran said and that possibility? Yeah, that could potentially happen. Like, because I was thinking, would you like that to happen? Um, do you I think that could know. be like such a shock ending yeah, that it would be a good thing? I would, like, I would like it to happen, but at the same time, no, I wouldn't want to win. <laughs> Like, do. It's like a big four pay per view. Is there gonna be like a like if they're just gonna have AJ Brock to finish off? Is it you know? Is there gonna be like some kind of like main? Nah, nah, Matt, Matt, you just reminded me of the point I made before. Sammy and Kevin Owens. 
Oh yeah, I, I forgot you haven't even brought them up. You've been I talking to us about this for forgot. so long. I completely forgot. Basically, Flame I thinks forgot. that <laughs> Sammy and Kevin are just going to cost SmackDown the win. That's it, isn't it? Yeah, I think they're going to interfere because they're like going to be extremely annoyed about the fact that they're left off the team and currently with how their whole characters have been yeah. in their fighting against like the authority figures and all their BS yeah. So, yeah. yeah, I think they're going to... All right, well... Course, there we go. Sorry, Flame. Did you have anything to add? Yeah, of course, the whole thing recently, we're like getting kicked off the tour and that, it all adds up to this and all mm. sorts of stuff. So. I agree. Yeah, that, I, that, I think that's a possibility. I, I think that could happen. I'm not going to really predict that because it could, could not. I think that I'm just going to leave that for Flame because I'm not confident about, too confident about that. But I think Team Raw will go over here. I think they'll win. Um, that's pretty much it. Thank you so much uh, to Kieran and Flame and D2 for doing these predictions. We, don't, we haven't done AJ yet. Oh yeah, AJ blessings <laughs> I'm so glad someone actually uh, actually remembered that. <laughs> wow. Okay then. Um, thank you, Kieran. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, <laughs> just happened. Uh, interesting. <laughs> Braun. I don't know. I start off with Braun. Okay, this is not going well. Uh, Flame, do you wanna do you wanna introduce the match? <laughs> Right, Brock Lesnar versus AJ Styles. They finally done a great thing and took the title off Jim Hall and gave it to the best wrestler in WWE. Absolutely. Um, Who have you got and why? But Brock Lesnar is going to win because it's Brock Lesnar. And even though the thing is with this match, like it has the potential to be so good, but it just depends on if Brock Lesnar is willing to not be a lazy so and so. But um. Yeah, I think, yeah, but... He won't. Win, he won't, not against AJ. What? He won't, he, not against AJ. No, I think... I he, won't, he, won't, he won't, he won't do that. I mean, like like you say, like, like not give, not give a, not give a crap in the match and just lazy and like... No, 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 I mean, you know, like he did against Dean Ambrose at WrestleMania. I don't think he will against... Right, Extreme Rules, whenever they had that awful match. Like, I'm so hoping, like... Brock gives it his all because so potential for matches. Brock Lesnar's winning. Yeah. Yeah. D two. Who have you got, man? D 2s muted. So I oh, know there's D two. <laughs> you got who? Brock. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's a. I think that's a good, uh, a good, a good shout. Who do you have, Kieran? Uh, I have. Brock to win. I just hope that the match is close to the level of the match Brock and CM Punk had. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. If it's yeah. as good as that, then I'm mm. happy for Brock to win. But I really don't see Brock losing. If it's one f five down for the pin, you know, like after nine minutes, that's not going to be great. Yeah. Um. All right. I'm, I feel like I'm being a D2 here, which is like, that's crazy for me to say, but uh... Don't put yourself down like that. <laughs> <laughs> I think, I think, I think I'm, I'm being a D2 here, and that, I'm, I'm honestly scared for my future now that I said that, but um... I'm gonna go with AJ Styles. Really? I'm gonna go with AJ Styles here. Why? Um... I just, yeah, just want AJ to win so much that I'm actually going to predict that. And, yeah, <laughs> AJ Styles. Yeah, 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 the only match I predicted wrong at Hell in a Sound, I'm thinking of it, because I did I did say that I got one wrong on every time, and that was uh, Kevin Owens versus Shane. I, I actually voted Shane as well, so I've been going with pretty crazy ones for the main event, but, come on, AJ's the best wrestler in the world. They gave us an awesome, like, high, the fact that he beat Jinder... In Manchester, that's such that's so cool, especially for English fans as well. Happened in England, in mm. Manchester, first time ever this championship. I don't know. I, I kind of feel like they're just gonna make AJ the kind of the face of the company, like for SmackDown at least. And just I don't know. I know it's crazy. I'm gonna stop it there. This video is so long. Thank you to everyone who came and made this video. You guys are awesome. Big shout out D Two Flame and Kieran. Guys, drop a like if you enjoyed. Let me know, of course, in the comments what you guys is, you guys is, what your predictions are, guys. Take care. Peace out. I'll see you soon.